Furbies. Now see, I don't think I was I don't think I was allowed to get Furbies. Not because they were like a girl toy. I think just because my mom just didn't want to get annoyed and like I, I was basically a human Furby. So she didn't want like twins. You know what I mean? Because that shit would have been but we did have a Stretch Armstrong that was demon possessed. Oh, do you guys want to hear fucking ghost stories? Oh wait, actually, bitch, this fucking lighting is kind of lit. I'm kind of living for this light. But you can see my no, you can see my my non shaved negotiation um situation. Okay, listen. All right, ghost story. Thank you, Davina. Okay, ghost story. Boots. So my dad built like this like. Do you hear the crows? It's probably just a bird, but let's pretend it's crows because this is a real true dark story. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, my dad built, um, you know, the gulp start coming when we talk about ghost stories. So my dad built um, a playhouse in the backyard like a little mini house so we can have, hi, yes, it's a door Delano. I called like five times. They even left a message with your mother. Follow this account. Um, so anyway, I have ADD. Um, oh yeah, my dad built, um, not only did he build a pond, but he built like us like a little like playhouse that was like a mini shed, but like a two story bunker like playhouse. And we would put our toys in there and we would play with our toys in this like bunker. And one time, first of all, my brothers never believed me that I would see spirits since I was like a fetus. Like they always were like, oh, she's very dramatic. Y todo. Like she doesn't really like, you know, make sense or like, they didn't, just didn't believe me because I was a very dramatical kid. You know, I had imagination, which one had to have growing up like this, you know, in the barrio, you know? Uh, <laughs> um, so I was convinced that Stretch Armstrong for those of you that don't know what Stretch Armstrong is look it up on Googs Stretch Armstrong was this like toy that you would stretch all his limbs and like you could stretch him really long and it was kind of gooey and he would like stretch back or whatever um, so this one was possessed by the fucking demonias bitch this one was possessed by demonic presence. I felt it. There was something dark about this toy's aura. And I used to always tell my brothers that toy, I, it always ends up somewhere totally different where I don't leave it. And one time it like peeked out like this to me. And I told my brother, I was like, it peeked out of the closet and looked at me. It kind of reminds me of those like elf on the shelf type of, oh no, those elf thingies where like they're supposed to draw on kids' faces and they like peek and stuff. It was very her. So I told my brother, I was like, this shit fucking like keeps like fucking with me. And I don't know if it was like in my head or something, but like my brother believed it because he saw it. So we got the fucking doll and we threw it in the shed and we're playing like hide and seek or whatever. And then my brother and I both like hid in the shed or whatever. And the fucking Stretch Armstrong had a fucking hammer in its hand. True story, bitch true story yeah goosebumps writers if you're looking for writers you can take this story i just want 20 percent because this fucking doll had the fucking hammer like of course he couldn't grip it because he stretched armstrong but it was like that in his hand and my brother and i were like and i was like i told you evil that fucking, yeah. Did you have a favorite 